So hello everyone. Today we have two job update from Medpace. And the first one is data coordinator and the other one is entry level software engineer. Now let's look into the data coordinator role. The job location is Navi Mumbai. Now let's scroll down and look at the responsibilities. Here in the responsibilities, they have mentioned something like you will need to track and maintain the metrics regarding the status of the data within the EDC system. And you will clean the clinical database which includes generating and resolving data clarification and you will reconcile the clinical data and you will assist with the support activities for data management department. Here we can simply know about this role where you will be managing the data and you will be cleaning the data and you will be assisting with the data management uh, activities. Yeah, then uh, let's look into the qualification that is required for this role. Here they have mentioned that bachelor's degree in life sciences or pharmacy or health related field with a strong attention to detail and also you need to know the working knowledge of excel and word and you need to have the knowledge of medical terminology and clinical research and this is preferred and then you need to have a good knowledge about the clinical database such as medidata rav is preferred for this role the second role is entry level software engineer and the job location is navi mumbai for this role now let's look into the responsibilities of this role here you will collect, analyze and document the user requirement. You will design, modify, develop and support the software applications. You will participate in software validation process throughout the development, review or execution of test plan, cases or scripts. You will create a software application by following the software development lifecycle, which includes the requirement gathering, design, development, test, release and maintenance. And then, you will communicate with the team members regarding the project, development, tools and procedure. And then you will utilize the skills in development areas such as including object oriented programming where you will use C sharp here and database that is SQL. In web application you will be using ASP.NET. And also there will be a potential opportunity to lead the software development projects. Now let's look into the qualification that is required for this role. Here, you will require a bachelor's degree in computer science and you need to have a experience using the technologies such as C-Sharp, Angular, Web Services, GraphQL, Git and Relational Database is preferred for this role. Experience in Entity Framework, Azure DevOps is advantageous. And then you need to have the understanding of software development lifecycle and software release management and also you need to have a prior experience in modernizing systems to the cloud based software such as Azure and it is a plus for you. And then you will need to have excellent analytical, written and oral communication skills in English. That's the end of these both jobs and if you are interested, please apply for this role as soon as possible. And if you have any other queries or feedback, please let us know in the comment section. And if you found this video helpful, hit the like button, subscribe and share it to your friends.